Hello everyone, delighted to be talking to you from one of my favourite venues in world football, the Orange Velodrome. I'm Derek Ray and adjacent to me in the commentary box is Stuart Robson and we're fully convinced this game will live up to its billing. It's France against Paris Saint-Germain. Well, it's always good to get off to a decent start and they certainly did that. Another win here and it will set the tone for the rest of the season. I think they could be a very useful outfit this campaign. Hernandez and a useful cross. Here's the side France will go with. Mike Mignon begins in goal. Kylian Mbappe starts with Moussa Diaby on the flanks. And they line up with just the one striker looking to do a bit of damage. Introducing the Paris Saint-Germain starters. Gianluigi Donnarumma stands between the posts. Marquinhos plays with Sergio Ramos at the back. Vitor Ferreira starts alongside Marco Verratti in the engine room. And leading the line, Lionel Messi plays alongside Kylian Mbappe. Oh, in with a chance! Are they going to forge ahead? Oh, my goodness! He's caught that so well! A goal of the highest class! Fantastic technique! Let's see this again, because the delivery into the box couldn't be any better. Played into just the right area, and the strike could not get any better. And it threw the back of the ball with such power. What a goal this is. Well, the ball is moving again, and the question is, how will PSG reply to that setback? Well, you don't really want to be picking up a caution so early in the game, Stuart. Well, he's going to be under pressure now. That was a reckless challenge. He didn't need to make it at all. Good pressure. Can they make something of this? Still not clear. Can he find the net? And the keeper getting across to stop it. Playing it short. Really good block. And very deftly cut out. Nordi Mukieli. Now with Messi. and teammates around him this looks more than decent Mbappe it's in they're looking really relaxed and confident and not giving the opposition much of a look in well here we can see it again look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself and from there he never looked like missing that's a lovely goal so underway again, and a 2-0 advantage here. Nicely timed tackle. Well, can do better in terms of the pass. Verratti, and it's a quality pass. Well, it comes to nothing in the end, offside. Well, he doesn't need to make his movement quite so quickly there. Just let the ball be played into the space. Diaby. And a throw in here for France. Diaby gives it a go. What a big chance that was. Keeper has the ball. Messi Ferreira Mukiele France come away with it Well France have controlled possession as you can see and as a result have dominated the game some of their passing movements have been a joy to watch and I don't think anything's going to change that well, let's see if they can win the ball back and create something else. Breaking at pace.
And he takes on the shot. Well, that was easy on the eye, and he didn't miss by much. Well, that's how to counter-attack. They did it with such pace. Just couldn't finish it off. Chouameni. Koro Mouani. Aurelien Chouameni. France moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? And the referee blows for a foul. Well read to put an end to that attack. Opportunity to deliver the cross. Oh, this is looking promising. Mbappe into the middle. That's all they can conjure for now. Verratti. Lionel Messi. Possession one. Could play it in. Mbappe. Determined defending. Mbappe. This might be ideal for the counter. Well, that break looked so promising, but nothing coming from it. Well, just narrowly over the crossbar. Good hit, though. Well, time is up as far as the first half is concerned here in Marseille. Well, here's something we don't say terribly often. Lionel Messi has been a long way from his best. Not making his mark in this game, Stuart. Yeah, he's just not found his form today. He doesn't look quite right. Unless he can impose himself on this game and start threatening the keeper, they're going to lose this one. So back in business, and it'll be different in the second half. Lionel Messi. Messi. Mbappe. And based on that challenge, you wouldn't be at all surprised if the referee reaches for his pocket. And he does produce the yellow card. Yeah, and it certainly deserved a yellow. It's a poor challenge, you have to say. And that short pass, this could be interesting. Nicely cut out. Verratti on the ball. What has he got up his sleeve? Verratti. Marquinhos. Now with Fabian. Mbappe. Gives it a go. Body on the line. It's a splendid run by Mbappe. But they dealt with the threat posed. Lionel Messi. Mbappe. Can he get one back? Brilliantly blocked. Fabian, determined block. Not what he was intending, bad pass.
Eduardo Camavinga. Kunde. France being afforded too much space here. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Will they profit from this situation? Really good high press. Lionel Messi! And oh, it's in! We cannot declare this contest over. They still believe. Well, as the replay shows, that's gone in off the post. His heart must have been in his mouth there. It's a good finish in the end. And away they go once more. And plenty still for Paris Saint-Germain to fire at in this game. Wasn't going to let that go. Well, deemed to have been a cautionable offence. Well, no question about it. He deserved his booking there. A short free kick this time. Ibrahima Konate might be able to get in behind the defence. Diaby, that's excellent defending following the cross. So a corner kick it'll be following the deflection. Well, they fancy a short one. Mbappe into the middle. Nice and easy for the keeper. Nuno Minj. Well, time just challenged magnificently. Oh, good looking run. He must finish. Rifled against the post, but back in play. Well, it came to nothing in the end. Mukiele. Now with Messi. Mbappe. Mbappe! Well, how close was that? Inches away. Well, we have 20 minutes left in this game. Oh, managing to beat him. Aurelien Chouameni. Not an especially strong challenge. Can he do it? And a goal to really bolster things for them. Two in front. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease. And it's just a change of pace. And from there, he never looked like missing. That's a lovely goal. So the ball is moving again. We've been treated to four goals. 3-1 the score. That's useful play. But quick thinking defensively. And into the last 15 minutes of action. Kamavinga. Mbappe with it. Good move in the making from France. The term. Mbappe. Teammates available. Messi. And offside here. He read the situation defensively and did his job. It will be a Paris Saint-Germain free kick. Well, he can consider himself admonished even in the absence of a yellow card. And collected tidily, he had plenty to think about. Well, the seconds are ticking away, and the home side in control. Stuart, what have you made of this? Yeah, clearly the better side. Obviously being fantastic up front, but it's their work ethic for me. They're just not happy. Off the post and back in play. Just the challenge that was required. And the counter-attack is on, options available. A lovely 
attempt. And a good save. Well, it is a good save. The idea was good, the execution wasn't. And that was a very fine read. Mbappe. Could pull one back here. Oh, marvellous save. Great goalkeeping. An alert intervention. Two minutes of stoppage time coming up. Marco Verratti. Mbappe with it. Really good high press. Well, there it is, the final whistle, and France have prevailed in this one. Stuart, your thoughts? Well, fairly comfortable in the end, wasn't it? Thought they controlled the middle of the park well. Going forward, there was some really nice incisive play too. It's a good result for them. Well, just the sort of performance they were looking for from the talented Kylian Mbappe. Well, he scored a good goal, he hit the woodwork and was a constant threat. So overall, he should be really pleased with his display.